yet still they hunger for battle. Remove their manhood, yet still they lust for conquest. Well, to be fair, two chicks in your crowd, the same. Well, they don't even have the latter, and they're still bloodthirsty as fuck. So. Yeah. I will make allies of whomever I deem useful. We have observed the actions of both Blackguard and Exile, and it is Pitaris and Vanya who give meaning to those actions. This Akara has not mixed with other than its own for over 200 years. The outside world has now discovered us, so it is time that we discovered it. Well, I suppose I can't be too angry at these people. They're probably quite inbred. Kira has the blood of Deshret in her veins and the bonds of Deshret in her mind. Her loyalty to her Akara is admirable. Her loyalty to the past is not. Tasuni has been corrupted since the day he was born. Maraketh's tradition would have it that such a warped child be left upon the moonlit plain for the gods to adopt. Tasuni was not taken by the gods that night. Such a thing has never happened before in our Akara. Now we know why. Tasuni is a man caught between two worlds, our world of light and the beast's world of darkness. He is our scout in the black, and without him, nightmare would remain beyond our understanding. And an enemy you cannot know is an enemy you cannot fight. I was figuring, thinking, well, you can still fight him, but say if you manage to strike it down, like blind fighting. You might even know you've struck it down, even if you've, uh, even if you have. Diala wishes the beast dead, but why? Why would a nightmare wish to kill a nightmare? A question of great interest, yet little importance. It does not matter why the sun rises and sets, as long as it continues to do so. Except it does matter. S Our hope say if she wanted to you. take the place of the nightmare. So if she wanted to ascend to the lofty throne herself, then you would trade in one nightmare for another nightmare. So questions uh, may, that may seem unimportant Anything you can need, be justice. quite important. Diala was there when it all went bad. If anyone can help put things right... Why would she? Ray class has been like this for almost 300 years. What's made her want to do something about it now? She's the Gemling Queen, Vanya. There's no way we could understand what goes on in that mind of hers. I know. And that's precisely what worries me. We well, kind of prodded her out of her super. Oyun gave us a home. Our lives back. Appreciate the good ones when you find them in Ray class. It's not like there are many. Indeed. Walking around behind me. And to over here in the future. To Sunni, he's a con man. Batarish just doesn't understand him. I understand that he gets his every need catered for by talking in riddles and telling the lies. The truth about the nightmare. He makes sense of the chaos as best he can. How can we possibly know whether what he's telling us is the truth or not? We can't. But who else is there to ask? Well, you can ask me, but I'm a sound protagonist. Take care. Well, mostly sound protagonist. I can say enough to prompt you certain conversation options. Soon. The Marrakesh are stranded in the sandstorm of reflection and regret. We look to Elsa Kemma to lead us out. Yet the sandstorm is all she knows. She needs me. Her eyes and ears in the darkness. But she will never comprehend my gifts. Diala has the form of a woman. Yet the substance is one part corruption and nine parts death. One day soon, you will see how lifeless she truly is. The Marakath speak of his betrayal, but Vo did what he thought was necessary to destroy the beast. Now he wonders the desiccation, tortured as much by his failure as by nightmare. Uh, I don't know what they mean by his betrayal, as in the Civil War. The Red Sakema was the woman who forged what it meant to be Maraketh. A people united. Sounds strong. different. Deshret led fires in the hearts of women and loins of men. When she fell, 
So did the Marrakesh. We've been falling ever since. He sounds the a different there. But whatever. I'm gonna unlock the next master, then I think I'm gonna call quits. I, ju I just wanna keep playing. But I know I have to stop at some stage. The Empire didn't need a cataclysm. It created its own desolation. Oh wait, I forgot to talk to... What's her face? What do you want? I've led many a war party against Vol and his unmen, and I've seen too many of my Dakara die. I shall look for your return, but I shall not expect it. As we give strength to the outside, we grow weaker on the inside. First, there was Pataris and Vanya. Now there is you. It shows how little faith Oyan has in us, in her own Akara. That she would treat blackguards and exiles with such admiration. But you could also argue that by using outside strength to deal with your problems, it is actually not taking away from your strength. Say if I die. Oh wow. The uh, their tribe hasn't lost anything. An outsider was the one who died, not them. They could be more free with my life than they could with, with one their own. Oyan is my Sikema, my commander. I am her Dikara, her warrior. I defend this Akara as Oyan sees fit. Whether Oyan is fit to see what is best for this tribe, it is not for me to say. My mother gave Tasuni to the gods. The gods gave him back, and I thank them for it every day. Given the choice, I would never have chosen Tasuni as my brother. But then, family is not about what you want. It is about what you need. Well, to be honest, I always took it as, um... Accidents of birth, but sure, that's a nice way of saying it. When a woman forgets how to die, a woman forgets how to live. Deshret said that to her Dakara on the day she killed Titushus, scourge of the Maraketh. I say this of Diala. When a woman knows nothing of life, how can she care for the living? And also, how the hell you do you will forget? Be remembered. Oh, thank you. Uh, how do you forget how to die? It's like, oh, oh shit, I'm, I have a bullet in me. Uh, what's meant to happen now? I'm I'm not really sure. Morrow killer, the mad. Your torment is over. Accidentally planted the back. There's a item you can get that gives you both. Uh, allows you to have multiple golems. And I'm looking to get a passive that gives me multiple golems. Uh, gets me another golem. If I had um, these items, um, there's one item you can make. You, it's three parts, sell to a vendor. Then you can no longer have any non golem minions. And golems are slightly nerfed, but you can have like four of them. Or four extra ones. So I could have like six golems going around, uh, which sounds cool, but I'm, I would much more prefer to have, say, three golems and other types of minions as well, and golems not to be that nerfed. Doesn't that sound much better? Vols. Ooh. Vols fallen. <coughs> Makes me think of uh, the uh, the 
other fallen that we've seen in the other areas. Yes. So, uh, this you. Superior, but I don't think I have the ability to use him just yet. Seventeen percent rarity, but if I put this on, this would actually. Mm, I might stick with what I have. This would increase my damage a bit. Let's increase cold damage a little. Just out. Um, 239. 259. You know what? Sure, it's only a slight decrease, but we'll go with it. Oh, that Be gave me careful. a whole orb. Damn. Yeah, I'm. I'm I think I will get rid of that. Okay, we'll socket this here so it starts gaining levels. But <coughs> I don't think it will uh, I'm not sure when I'll be able to use it. I'll have to stick a fourth socket onto one of these. What can we do for you? Until next time. nearly leveled up. Nice. And... Ooh! Legendary Bronze Scepter. I've seen that thing before. Isn't that to the... When you get at the... Outside the prison? Yeah, it is. It's kind of annoying to see it again. Didn't think you could get it outside of that one tank. Yes, it's not that it's not one of those ones. Basically some can only be gotten via prophecies. Um or certain cards. Yeah, I guess that isn't one of them. Or maybe there's some that can only be gotten by certain cards. But prophecy ones can be gotten in general. I have no idea. Fuck yeah. Uh, ooh, also this is a tank. But no. Okay, let's see. Tree... 306. Get this. 316.4. And we can also now upgrade some of these. This is onto 8 Phantasms. It's still eight. But my <coughs> <coughs> melee range is much superior now. Well, it's a bit superior. Oh, and I still have my phantasm. Not surprising. Here's a syndicate guy. It's a caravan. The Deadly Swift took a wild, beautiful animal. Stick together. What a racket! I the guess it's back to work then. Ow! Was not anticipating that much damage. Um. Okay, here's the exit. So if we 
just continue along this way, we will run into them. say now that you fucking kill me. Uh, he's gonna pop out. Thanks for the excitement, exile. They're after getting burrier, and I think if they're burrier burrow enough that I can't justify just throwing myself into the thick of it. I just get uh, rather anxious because it all time limit tank. And feel like, gotta end it now, gotta end it now. But trying to end it now just gets me fucking stopped. I don't care for material things, but perhaps you do. She's here. She take out her own bit of gear, which gives a bleed on hit, and her bit of gear. Yes, do so. Creating timed item traps. Careful. I remember scoping up on that. I'm glad we could come to an understanding. Ow. Died very few times so far, and for that I'm appreciative, but I'm still not a fan of dying at all. It makes me feel like it's the start of going back to how the other guy was. Amount of damage. Um, but it's it's only like that because it's missing the other things that uh, the fire has on that reduce its damage. Reduce and increase its damage. Because really it is doing X more damage. It just it's statistically reduced from uh, on the whole individual strike tank. Like it, it can now hit three enemies and trigger, in like say if there's three enemies in the fight, and nine balls are triggered instead of just two. All right, three. Christ! Just brought sin him down. Is the crack through which nightmare seeps. What was your sin, Vol? Pride. When the sun sets, the plains should be red. Ooh. That inherently increases our mental resistances. Actually, it's a yeah, that has been true for them all. Oh, that's even that's really nice. It's eight percent better. Hmm. Damn. Okay. Swap this out. Ah. I wouldn't know where to start with that. There we go. That is annoying. Can't swap them out just yet. I will need to go fix the uh, swap intelligence onto the other thing first. Get 
attack and cast speed increased. Rank 1. I vowed to care for this empire with my eyes open. I lied to my people. I lied to myself. Blinded by my lust for purity, I placed my faith in the most corrupt of men. I watch now as my legion dies, their flesh melting from their twisted bones. They fall and rise. A tide of mortal death and eternal damnation. I feel it now in my own flesh. The heat, the corruption. I have failed you, my empire of purity. Do not forgive me, but please, I beg of you, survive me. I do love that one. That the last bit there, I do like it. Okay. Um. All right. Let us sort out this intelligence issue. Eight. Oof. Do I have an orb of alchemy? No, I don't. And I don't have the thing that upgrades a magic to a rare either. That's uh, actually a more awkward thing to get. Suffolk smart. Kind of another Suffolk smart. Can get more intelligence. Okay, I can swap them around. Let's get rid of some things. I will hold on to this one for the time being. Reasoning being that I could get... I, ooh, it's different quality levels. Um, basically, I can... Uh, if I can get a, a normal bronze scepter, a magic one, and a rare one, I can sell those three and that one for some orbs of chance.
Hello. Greetings. Okay. Oh, Nico. I love Nico. I not digs around in the bellies of beasts for signs from the first ones. And Nico digs around in the ground with a big metal spike. And he talks to the first ones just like I do. Or I think he does. He talks to someone. And what a voice. He is very skinny, though. I'm not sure he will be a survivor. 